Baptism is a symbol of what Jesus did for us in his death, burial, and resurrection. Being lowered in the water represents our old life dying. Life dying. Just as Jesus was dead and buried, our past and future sins are gone forever. We are forgiven. We are forgiven. When we are raised out of the water, it represents our new life in Christ. Just as Jesus was resurrected, we are a we new, are creation. new creation. The old is gone. The new has the come. New has come. Today, today we celebrate as people, people take their next step. step and tell the world that Jesus has brought them from death to life. To life. To life. Today we celebrate the miracle of a changed life based upon their profession in Jesus Christ. In the name, in the of, the name Father, of the Father, the, the Son, Son, and the Holy Spirit, we are buried with Christ and raised to, and walk. Raised to walk in newness of life. Newness of life. in newness of life. Well, I want to welcome you guys this morning. This is one of our favorite Sundays because um, we get to really, truly celebrate uh, lives that have been transformed. Every life up here has a story. From the youngest up to the oldest has a story of what God has done in their lives. And today, as they go into the baptism waters, did y'all think we could get a hot tub in here? You probably didn't, okay? It's not as warm as a hot tub, but it is fairly warm, okay? But what, what is it about going under the baptism waters? We had a class on Tuesday night with all these guys, and, and going under, there's nothing magical about the water, but going under the water is saying, I'm leaving my old self behind. I don't know about you, but when I needed to leave my old self behind when I started following Christ, and coming up out of that water is saying, I am a new creation in Jesus, and I have decided to live for Jesus. And every one of these people up here, I am so proud of you guys. I am so proud of you because you are saying today, you know what, in front of God, in front of my family, in front of my church family, I'm letting everyone know that I've decided to live for Jesus. Can we just give these guys a hand before we even introduce them? Um, I'm going to introduce these guys to you and then they're going to share um, why they have decided to get baptized today. So my first friend that I want to introduce that I have known since she literally was born is my friend Ashlyn. Can you wave, Ashlyn? This is Ashlyn. And she's going to let me read it, why she wants to get baptized today. Ashlyn says, I want to get baptized because I am in God's family. Amen. Thank you, Ashlyn. And then my next friend is Daniel. Daniel, can you tell us why you want to get baptized today? All right. I want to get baptized again. This isn't my first time. But I want to resubmit myself yet again to Christ. I got re uh, baptized a long time ago. However, I picked up my old self, and it led to a lot of things I'm not proud of and a lot of sinful acts. And today, I want to resubmit myself to God and change the way I'm living. Amen. Amen. And then my friend Logan, can you tell us why you want to get baptized? Well, I want to get baptized because I'm ready to start living for Christ. I grew up in church, but I never really took the extra steps to sort of follow him and really read up on his word. And the past couple of years, I kind of found myself in a bit of a dark place, and I've started coming to see life and started realizing that God is glorious, and this is awesome. So I'm excited. Amen. 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 My friend Sierra, can you tell us why you want to get baptized? Um, today I want to get baptized to start my new journey as a believer and to walk with Christ. Amen. Amen. Let me see who's next. On my Lily. Sorry, I had to look at my list. Lily, can you tell us why you want to get baptized? Uh, I want to dedicate my life to Christ and follow in his footsteps. And I want to take this leap of faith and announce my dedication and commitment to Christ. Amen. <laughs> Guys, I'm telling you, it doesn't get better than this. It does not get better. Mason, can you tell us why you want to get baptized today? I'm ready to give my life to Jesus and follow in his path. The first time I got baptized, I didn't, I don't feel like I knew what I was saying yes to. So, amen. So, here she is today. 
Okay, where's my friend Caroline? Caroline, can you tell us why you want to get baptized today? Because I want to be part of God's family. Amen! Yes. Yes. And where is Brody? Brody, can you tell us why you want to get baptized today? I want to get baptized because my parents got baptized. Awesome. Yes. Awesome. Yes. Let's see. Maddie. Where's Maddie? I want to be baptized because it brings me closer to God, and I want to publicly confess my faith. Amen. And this is Hannah. Hannah, why do you want to get baptized? I'm being baptized because God worked a miracle for me. I had so many people praying for me when I wasn't doing too well. I was in the hospital for one week for a traumatic brain injury, and God worked all those prayers because, because I'm just about fully healed. Since he, did all that, since he did all this for me, I would like to declare that I am now a true follower of Jesus. Amen. Amen. And many of you were ones that prayed for Hannah, and we are so excited about that. Emily, can you tell us? Here, you guys get up here. This stage, I feel like I'm going to fall off it. Here you go. Right here. Emily, tell us why you want to get baptized. Um, I want to rededicate my life to Jesus. I got baptized about a year ago, and I felt that I lost my connection with God. So I thought the best way to rebuild my relationship is by getting baptized again. Thank you, Emily. This is my friend Aviana. Aviana, can you tell us why you want to get baptized? I'm being baptized today because I have felt I haven't had the best relationship with Jesus. I want to follow in his footsteps and be baptized. Amen. Amen. 